Hey there everyone, I'm Balkifanoit, and welcome back to Tales of Destiny! Last time we ended the raid of Batista, and shockingly enough, <laughs> he killed himself. I sound a little bit too jolly for that, he killed himself! Yeah, yeah it was sad, I swear. <laughs> And today, we are gonna leave Moreau and we are gonna point our noses towards Terassi, where we are gonna take out the king. Still think that sounds a little bit too extreme, but okay. But before leaving, we have some more stuff for to do in this town. Because after we defeated Batista, we can now go and talk to this guy again. It'll cost you a flat 500 gold to take the boat anywhere you like, and then come back here. Okay, so we want to go. The house in Southern Moreau. So let's go. Is the boat actually going faster now? I think so, actually. Why didn't you go this fast when we went to the castle? That was boring. <laughs> I actually had to speed that up, sheesh. Anyway, the only reason we came here is this treasure chest, which got a miracle gel in it. Actually very nice. A part of the floor has been destroyed. Yeah, okay, too bad. <laughs> and, this, and now we want to go to the house in Northern Morrow. Because there's even more treasure to get there. Extremely exciting, I know. <laughs> you don't need to do this, of course, optional stuff, but treasures. Free stuff is always good. <laughs> but you know that already, don't ya? No. Oh. oh, there's actually a house north of the bulletin board, too. <laughs> a creepy cat house, apparently. Anyway, we get a squid jerky and bee flakes. I guess bee flakes. Oh, bonito flakes. Okay, both are food items. 250 and 100. Not bad. Anyway, are you a crazy cat lady or something? I know she is talking and all, but all that, all I can think of is... <laughs> yes, that was my best impression of the crazy cat lady in Simpson. Sucked, I know. <laughs> Usual cat statue. Indeed. This was a little bit different though. Uh, nothing. Okay, fine. So, now there's one more place that we want to go. And it is Neptune, the arms shop. Because we want some new armor and stuff and stuff. Since we couldn't get it before, because this boat wouldn't take us there. But now we can! By the way, the equipment shop, I don't really care much about. Of course, they only have gels and normal items, which I don't really care much for. Since, well, <laughs> the Moreau Castle gave me a lot of those already, so what's the point, really? Anyway, I want to buy... Oh, the quartz road is actually Earth Elemental. I didn't know that! I do not want to buy that one, though. Expensive! Sheesh! 100? Hmm, not bad. Anyway, I want to buy three cross helms and three light shields. Of course, for my melee fighters. So let's equip it. Cross helm. Light shield. Wait. Oops. <laughs> Go. Light shield, and cross helm. There we go. A little upgrade. Better than nothing, I suppose. So let's just go back to the pier now, and let's head to the uh, the harbor. So we could leave this so we can leave this place. Where's my speedboat button? I missed my speedboat. It's a nice throwback to Tales of Fantasia though. I mean, Venice and all. It's or Venezia. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> Venezia. That's a little bit too realistic, dude. Go back to the game world. <laughs> But yeah, nice little throwback to Venezia and Fantasia. That was a beautiful, beautiful town. I actually want to replay the game again. Ah, then. Anyway. So, Faith and... Uh, ah, Liana. Yes, yes, I, I, I forgot her name. All right here, of course. So we want to talk to them too when we are ready to leave. But before leaving, I want to equip a new disc on Philia. I want her to get the Wall of Flame disc. Why? Well, you'll find out. Are you ready to go? Fine, then we're leaving for Tarasi. Alrighty. So, by Moreau, you're... not fun at all. <laughs> Damn you, dungeon. 
But I'm, I'm done with this place now. I'm not gonna talk about it anymore. Thank God. Let's just have a perfect boat trip to Tarasi. Nothing's gonna stop us. <sighs> oh, son of a bitch. Johnny? Stan? Who's Eleanor? Uh, hey, Stan! She grew up with Fate and me. She was uh, Fate's lover. But she passed away. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry, and I, I'm sorry I asked. It's quite alright. But you know, there's someone I'll never forgive until the day I die. I let people think I was just a harmless clown to disguise my true intentions. I've been waiting a long time to settle the score. Vengeance will be mine. Whoa, uh, Johnny got a dark side. Johnny? Whoa, uh, <laughs> sorry, I didn't mean to bring you down like this. A song, yeah, I'll sing a song to change the mood. Good idea. Alrighty then, here's my latest two. Eh? What was that? It sounded like we collided with something. Uh, I hope we didn't run aground. Good grief! Guess not. What happened? Monsters! Monsters? We're being boarded! What? Please, get out! Hurry! Of course, we can't just have a... Uh, we, we can't just have a peaceful trip out to sea, of course not. Is it the sea dragon again? Is it gonna take Johnny down to a ru to ruin some ruins to get his sword in too? That would actually be pretty cool. Oh no. What the? Get it before the ship goes down. Okay, I just have to say it. Release the Kraken! Yeah, I seriously had to say it. It's written in my YouTube partner contract. It says, if you ever know that a Kraken is gonna appear in a video game, or a Kraken already appeared in a cutscene, you always have to say, RELEASE THE KRAKEN! I'm serious. It's the same with over 9000. Anyway, let's take down the Kraken. And yes, I'm so full of bullshit. <laughs> Anyway, the Kraken. This thing is surprisingly easy. He is weak to fire, which is why I gave Philia the Wall of Flame disc. Leon, can you be a dare and use spectacles on him? And ladies, go to town. Firestorm. Firewall. Now, of course, it's up to you if you want Stan to stay back and also spam spells, or if you want him to run up to the Kraken and physical attack, since Dimlos will do a lot of damage. Personally, I prefer Stan just going up and wailing on him and cutting him down to sushi. It's uh... <laughs> I, I think that the ladies will do a good enough job with the spells. Wow, a thousand, yeah. No, don't you dare come over here, Rudy. You are gonna continue casting spells. With Fire Storm and Fire Wall, this thing will not survive long. I will say though, I think this thing looks pretty cool. It's no space kraken, I will say that, but eh, it's okay. <laughs> it's a Kitty Girls Uprising reference, by the way. Anyway, so this thing actually has something you want to steal from him, if you want, of course. The chances of stealing is a little bit low, but but if you want to, go ahead. It's a question mark jewel, by the way. A aquamarine, to be exact. I don't think that's gonna work. He's a little bit too big for that. Okay, last last try. Come on. Did she? No, last try. I'm gonna try again. There we go. Alrighty. It's a bit annoying to steal from this guy since he attacks so much, but eh, not that bad to be quite honest. But now, you're toast. Or uh, fried fish. Eh. <laughs> this thing should be dead now though when Firewall and Firestorm hits. So. It's a very easy boss. So, <laughs> he does have a very, uh... Oh wow, he actually survived that. He actually have a very damaging spell, though. It's a... <laughs> tidal Wave. Yeah. It, it looks cool, though, but wow, does it hurt. I think actually we'll be able to one-shot Rudy if he actually hit with it. Surprise, he actually survived that. Oh! <laughs> and that's it for the Tentafool!
yeah, Kid Icarus again. <laughs> and like every good boss, he explodes. Multiple times. And we get the question mark jewel that I was talking about. Sweet. You say Aquamarine, yeah, I already said that. Phew, that was harsh. But we should be able to infiltrate the enemy's headquarters now. Headquarters? It's a city! Just... It's a city, that's... <laughs> it's not headquarters, you know. We arrived. Thanks, man. We'll return to Moreau and bring more reinforcements here. Try to buy some time until then. You better hurry up. That is, if you want a piece of the action, we might just have the enemy begging for mercy by the time you come. Great, <laughs> so be it. They're probably a Terrassi castle in the center of town. No more of this sneaking around stuff now. We're going to bust through their defenses and blow them away. Right. Alright, so... Welcome to Terrassi, I will say. Or we're not really in Terrassi quite yet, but... And I will say, I like the music here, but I don't really like this town. We have the warehouses right here, but I'm gonna do that those later on, I think. Instead, let's go to Terrassi. Probably the dullest and most boring town in the game. I'm not even kidding. The music is good though, but you can already hear that. <laughs> When I ask you which direction you want to go, turn the direction you want, and then choose. Yes, this place is a little bit different from uh, Moreau. Which direction do you want to go? Down or left? Of course, since we... If we go down, you just go back to the harbor. We want to go left. And there are some items we can get if we just go the right way. So I'm gonna get those right now. Want to go left again. And one more left. And then up into the house. I really like the music in this place, but just because of the boat gimmick, I'm not a huge fan of the place because it's a bit slow. Anyway, we get another miracle gel. Wow. And a pine gel. Sweet. There's really no point in talking to the people here that are just... Uh, well, they're not really positive, I suppose I can say. <laughs> anyway, there's more treasure for us to get, so let's go. Up, I believe. Actually, I do. I remember this place quite well. Or at least I want to think that. <laughs> want to go up into the next house. For another treasure chest, which have a life bottle in it. And you see the... Uh, two little treasures up there. We can't get those yet, sadly. But we want to go over here. Because if we do this, we open a door so we can move on. The water gate has opened. Yes, yes. Get back to the boat. I know this is very, very interesting and oh my god, so exciting, but believe me, when we are done with the boat gimmick, it's gonna be pretty, uh, Pretty interesting. It's a incredibly cool but long dungeon. <laughs> I want to go down. We we want to go through the door that we just opened, I believe. So right and then up again. Don't worry, we are done with this now, pretty much. You could try to go through the uh, to the shop, but there's. They won't uh, sell you any weapons or anything, sadly. You just go uh, up after the uh, <laughs> the switch, the switch palace. Yeah, you just go up there instead of down, and you will get to the you will go to the weapon shop. But they won't sell you anything, sadly. I left, I believe, and we sh this should take us to the uh, the castle. I might be wrong though. <laughs> I hope not. Oh, uh, left. Did I just go the wrong way? No, I did not. Good, good. So, let's go up here and welcome to Terrassi Castle, which got some awesome music, I will say that. But we are gonna go through, or at least think about starting this incredibly long dungeon next time. 
So, I thank you all for watching, and I see you all there.